The original intent when I formed uh, Natural Horizons Wellness Center was to, to bring different specialties, different practitioners together because I knew that health problems were very comprehensive, very integrative, meaning they had to address many issues. And so the um, original design was to bring practitioners together. But we have a chiropractor here. We have uh, a naturopath. We have several physicians working with us. We have people who do manual therapy, craniosacral therapy. We have people who address the issues of uh, addiction, counselors. I forgot uh, we have an acupuncturist here because that whole energy medicine part is a very, very critical uh, component. No matter what I need in my health regime, it's here. When I was having treatment and I was feeling nauseous, Natural Horizons Wellness Center had an acupuncturist working with me. And that took care of that. Anything that I needed. The cornerstone of our program uh, is targeted low-dose chemotherapy or what we commonly refer to as insulin potentiation therapy or IPT. Insulin does uh, a couple of things to, uh, to the uh, cancer cells. Uh, one of them is to get them in the uh, roughly the same phase of uh, growth to make them susceptible to, uh, to our chemotherapy. If we can get those receptors to open up or be uh, receptive uh, you know, to you know, the chemotherapy, those insulin receptors on the cancer cells are going to be uh, wide open. Now this enables us to give uh, chemotherapy that's less toxic to the patient's immune system, less toxic to their bone marrow, uh, they're able to tolerate um, the chemotherapy uh, much better. People would be surprised, I guess, if you could tell them that I could drive an hour and a half up here for my treatment. I could take my treatment, rest a little bit, and drive an hour and a half home. The, the, the process begins by working with the lifestyle changes that have to take place in order for us to uh, get the immune system uh, up back, healthy, uh, out of its compromised state. The first day I arrived, I was able to meet with um, Karen, the nutritionist, and we talked about um, the do's and don'ts, um, more things I needed to be aware of in terms of choices that I was going to make um, about my daily diet, how we could do the chemosensitivity blood test, which I quickly understood was really important uh, for me because they could send my blood to this lab in Greece and they would test my tumor cells for uh, specific chemotherapy drugs, I think a total of 20 of them, and see how my tumor cells reacted to those drugs. When I get this chemosensitivity test back, there may be uh, a number of four or five uh, drugs that the tumor appears to be uh, sensitive to. What it enables me to do is if the patient should develop uh, resistance to any given uh, uh, regimen. I can easily switch them to, uh, to another one. I was not willing, and I'm still not willing, to go just standard of care. I believe there's other approaches that are much less abusive to the body and much, less, uh, much kinder to your lifestyle and still fighting the cancer. Okay, so this is why I came here. And they have a lot of uh, wonderful facilities with their spa, and the uh, naturopathic uh, doctor, Dr. Bennett, who is here. The diet that I recommend for the patients in our program is primarily a whole foods diet, meaning that they're eating foods in the form that you would find them in nature, or very close to that form. Hopefully eliminating um, those refined foods that have a very negative impact on the immune system, on blood sugar control, on endocrine function, so that the body can really devote its energy towards fighting cancer. Um, and people generally feel much better when they're on a whole foods diet. We have a, a large biological dental operation here. And of course we all know that there's a dental component in many of the cancers that we see. So every patient coming in here uh, gets a free full examination and consultation with one of our biologic dentists. The dental component, meaning dental infections, um, uh, toxic materials that are used, for example, amalgam with mercury in it, the bite relationship, how the uh, jaws relate to each other, all affect 
a person's health. And so as a biologic dentist, my uh, intent is to be able to identify what dental problems contribute to overall health issues like cancer. We begin by detoxifying using a variety of uh, methods here at the center that include things like colon hydrotherapy. We have a far infrared sauna here. We do lymphatic drainage, ionic foot baths, kidney, liver, gallbladder flushes, etc. Once the body begins to detoxify, the immune system begins to recover. I walked in with stage four non-Hodgkin's lymphoma and a little over a year later, I was actually clean. Can't say enough um, about how every week and then each month into the process, I knew um, that from my body, I was making the right decision and taking a targeted approach to um, attacking the cancer. The people who get well are those who follow our program like a religion, to the letter of the law. That means following the diet, doing the detox, doing the immune enhancement, and not missing any of these treatments, and working within the program uh, to, uh, to get the, the necessary effect. I know in my heart of hearts that everything Natural Horizons did for me and taught me has saved my life and actually I believe it saved the lives of many others that I speak with and speak to about Natural Horizons Wellness Center.